Welcome to the Magnolia Minute. I'm Corey Poole, and today I have with me Janae Bittescombe, Director for the Louisiana Sports Hall of Fame and Northwest Louisiana History Museum. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good. That's a mouthful, man. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, y'all have some events coming up. The first one I'm really excited about is this Saturday. Yes. Tell us about it. This Saturday at 2 o'clock, we're going to have uh, the Clementine Hunter, A Case of Forgery. And we're going to have a special agent from the FBI, Randy Deaton, um, who is part of the Our Crime Task Force for the FBI, who investigated this whole forgery case and actually got people, the forger, convicted and so on, uh, to just sort of follow the leads and follow what happened throughout the whole process. And, uh, you know, Clementine Hunter is such a beloved figure up here. Yes that um, I know it's, people are going to love it. I think it's going to be a, such an interesting program. I'm looking forward to it. I've never seen him speak, and I think it's going to be very interesting. Two o'clock on Saturday. Yes, and, and then the majority of your events are free and open to the public. Yes, I'm sorry, free and open to the public. Come, ar come around quarter or two, and that's when we'll start letting people in for the program. Gotcha. All right, and then right on the heels of that, you have a photography exhibit? We do. We have an exhibit opening on April 26th. Now, that's going to be 5 to 7 p.m. at night, um, and that's Friday night, for the plantation photographs of Robert Tebbs. And as part of that opening, we'll have refreshments, you know, wine and cheese reception, and then we're going to have Dr. Tony Lewis, who actually wrote the book on Robert Tebbs and his uh, photographic experiences, at 5.30 as a lecture as part of that. And that is also free and open to the public, and they're putting the exhibit up now, and it's beautiful. And if you're into architecture or even sort of the history of plantations in the area, uh, in Louisiana, um, I think that you're really going to enjoy this. Yeah, that's that would have been my next question: is what are what kind of photographs? But it's really more of an architectural uh, exhibit. So that's what the photographs were taken for. It's yeah. taken in the 30s as part of Habs. Okay. Um, th that was happening in the 30s, and so. Uh, that was sort of the focus of it. And then we added the local components. So we'll have Magnolia and uh, Oakland and Melrose Plantation also um, as part of the exhibit. Oh, wonderful. I do love architecture, so yes. I'm, I'm looking forward to that. And then on the heels of that, we yes. have... Yes, and in June, we have <laughs> the uh, Louisiana Sports Hall of Fame induction weekend, and that kick, kicks off on June 6th. It's a little earlier this year. It's the first oh. weekend instead of the last weekend of June. Yeah. So June 6th is going to be the Le Cap Welcome Reception at the Museum from 5 to 7. That's um, Thursday. And free and open to the public. And then they have other activities going on throughout the mm -hmm. weekend, but the other, I uh, you know, on Friday night, there'll be on the riverbank again with a concert and the tailgating that you can buy tickets to. And then on Saturday night will be the induction ceremony up at the event center. Awesome. Y'all have a lot going on. We do. And those are all ticket. those ticketed events you can get through lasportshall.com. But okay. the, the welcome reception will be at the museum and that you don't have to buy a ticket for that. That's free. Okay. And talk to us about if anyone just wants to stop by the museum, your hours. Yep. We are open Tuesday through Saturday from 10 to 430. And our prices are $5 for adults, $4 for seniors, students, and military, and six and under are free. Right. And school groups are free. If you, if you call us and book in advance, you, your school group can come for free. Awesome. All right. Well, if you're interested in Northwest Louisiana history, if you're interested in sports history, if you're interested in art, check out the Louisiana Sports Hall of Fame and Northwest Louisiana <laughs> History Museum. And as always, thanks for watching.